First to breaking news at the South Australian Cricket Association where a major change is in the win. Let's go live to Tom Wren at Adelaide Oval. Tom, Captain Johan Bota looks like he's on the way out. Yeah, that's exactly right, Treaders. He will no longer be the, skippers of, the skipper of the Redbacks, and that is effective immediately. Now, that is a massive call, given that he has been here for a few seasons and he is contracted until the end of the season. But given that there have been some changes lately here at the Saka and at Adelaide Oval with the Redbacks, they felt that they wanted to go in a younger direction. Now, our understanding, Nine News, is that Johan Bote has taken the news very, very well. He's fully cooperative and he is willing to work with the new young skipper. And he may, in fact, stay on with the strikers for next season going forward. That is still a large possibility and it's still not known whether or not he will play out the rest of the season with the Redbacks. But certainly he's been cooperative. He's been a major part of the Redbacks for the past few seasons and he's willing to go on. Now, Tom, that's absolutely huge news, but it raises the question, who replaces him? Well, that's the big one, Treaders, and this may come as a shock to some, but young gun Travis Head, only turned 21 last month, will be the captain of the Redbacks. The Saka are going to announce this in the next couple of days. This is a huge decision, a massive responsibility for a young man who was only 21, has only played a couple of seasons of first-class cricket. He's a huge talent, though. We saw him at the Strikers. He is a massive, prodigious talent. I think will play for Australia, but this is a huge burden for him, and he's going to need some help with it going forward but a massive call by the Redbacks to give him this responsibility. Treaders. Thanks, Tom. Tom run there live at Adelaide Oval. Uh, repeating the news is that Johan Bota will step aside for Travis Head.